It's a goal. What the f was that? All right, three and three. Here we go. I'm uh, I'm gonna get a G7. We're gonna crash, bro. I feel it. I just said it in my brain. <laughs> I just said it in my brain. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna tap that button, and we are gonna Let's crash so fucking hard. It's gonna be great. And then we're gonna look in the kill feed, and Design Pool's gonna die by lava. I saw hey, into the future. Ready, boys? Here we go. Crashing, crashing through the snow oh. on a one horse open sleigh. Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> I told you, bro. I fucking told you. I know these things. When I feel it, bro, when I feel it, I tell you when I feel it, bro. Welcome to the Horizon Guide, everybody. All right, we're finally going to get it finished now. <laughs> so I'm going to kind of go through the talking points. And uh, first one is utilizing Horizon's passive. There is so many, so many beautiful things you could do with this. It's my favorite passive in the game. It's probably the most broken passive in the game because you can be so, uh, be so active with it. Basically, Horizons Passive allows you to not take any fall fatigue, is what it's called. So, what that means is, is that means you can fall from very, very high distances and not get that, like, thump. Good explanation of that. So, I'm playing Lifeline, and I drop down, I get that thump, right? Boom, right? When you're playing Horizon, and you get that Q, and you fall, if you hold your crouch... You slide. So she gets no fall fatigue whatsoever. This can do wonders as far as passives go, or as far as like running goes. So as far as running, the idea behind the passive horizon is always be moving. It's the most mobile legend in the game. Like it's crazy. I see him. Yeah, you might over here yeah. if you can. <sighs> hey, he went down the hill. So let's say I'm running, right? Let me just do this. So let's say I'm running. I need to escape someone. I'll pop a battery midair, crouch slide, and I'm able to get out, right? So being able to use the passive, using the terrain, I'm able to slide away and get to cover. So using your Q to heal, you'll see it from most top tier horizons. Every time they're in trouble, they always will, st will throw a Q and then start popping a battery. A lot of what we do is we'll throw a Q forward, we'll slide into the Q while popping our battery. So again, let's say I'm sliding, I'm like, oh, I'm popping my battery, going up. So I pop it early, I can jump off, stay mobile. It has a very, very, very short cooldown, which you can extend in multiple ways. One way is obviously with gold helmet, you can increase it, toss your Q out. So I think it's like 12 seconds. What you can do is, is right before it's gonna hop off, you hop on and you can make it last a couple extra seconds. So as the, you can actually game. extend the queue an extra couple seconds. So if your teammates can come help you, if, or if your teammates need it and it's about to go away, you can actually prolong it by sliding from the bottom. It does not work at the top. It, it will go away once you reach the top. So it will extend the queue by, again, a couple extra seconds. So that's a good way of utilizing Horizon's queue and getting kind of extra juice out of it. So it's really, really good to utilize the queue that way. If you want it to last longer with a shorter cooldown, obviously you can throw it in the air. So again, throw it straight up in the air. I'm like, wait for it to land. And then you can hop on it, right? And you can shoot people, shoot people, shoot people, shoot people. You're fighting, you're fighting. And you hop off of it again. And then hop back on it, right? And you're making it last a couple extra seconds. So it's a good way to, to kind of prolong your queue. That way you get more poke off. You get more information longer. And your queue is already back on cooldown. So you're able to use it again. That's another thing about Horizon is our queue is on such a short cooldown that it allows you to be super, super, super aggressive with it. I sometimes throw it just like hop over a wall. I'm not even kidding. I, I, I throw that thing all the time. I love it. It's probably my favorite. Mixed with her passive, it's just insane. Not only that, the grav lift allows you to be very, very mobile. So another thing about the grav lift is you have 100% accuracy on the grav lift. If you use the grav lift, you have 100% accuracy the whole way up and at the top, right? So if I hop off of it, toss it out, you're going to shoot somebody. You have 100% accuracy the whole time. Bloodhound knock. Oh, that bloodhound. Yo, 100% accuracy going up the queue. Clip it. Give it to Mike. That's another clip. Give it to Mike. You can make yourself extremely mobile. You can just kind of like go back and forth, go back and forth. You just kind of like 
you can go around in circles just don't go too far you'll learn like the pattern but you can just kind of like really balance like and really kind of really playing the 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 top so you don't get shot that really comes in handy when you're popping a battery so example of that would look like um you know say i take an arc star i just got hit right i'm gonna then wait i'm gonna pop a battery and i'm just gonna go in circles right and then i'm gonna hop off so it allows you to be extremely extremely hard to hit so you're able to pop that battery at the top of your queue. Again, Horizon's a really, really good legend to get you out of sticky situations. Not only that, a lot of people are going to take your queue. They're going to get jump fatigue. You're not. So putting a decent space between you and your and your enemy is, is, is just really f***ing good. Furthermore, Horizon's queue, it can block doors. I did this yesterday in my yesterday's VOD. You know, I did it a couple of times. People are coming into my building. And what you can do is let's say there's a door right here. You can actually throw a queue at the door and play like play on the side they cannot push in like if i need to get over here i can't it'll just kick me back there's a wall right here i physically cannot go past that spot i have to wait for that queue to disappear another trick you can do as well is if you throw it on the door in the building and you are really in a pinch so let's say this is the door what you can do is is you can shoot people you know they, they can't come inside right your team is like we need more time type of thing remember what i told you you can hop on your queue and you'll balance on the top and make it last another couple extra seconds. Again, it's an easy way to extend and prolong the period of time. So that way your queue's back up for cooldown. You could still throw nades through doorways. Mm, kind of. Because what happens is, let's say somebody throws a nade. Let's say I throw an arc star, right? Let's say I throw an arc star at this guy. It'll float in the air. See? So the arc star will... So any throwables that you throw at the queue will bounce. That includes any throwable gibby dome caustic alt horizon alt anything so a lot of times what happens is is if like i toss my queue out um depending on where they are you can actually land your queue right on top of them if you plan it right so this is just takes a lot of practice but i can get my alt right there if i just toss my queue out toss my alt it'll bounce and it should land like right on top horizon alt sucks people in and, and brings them all together now what I always do with Horizon, this is the bread and butter of Horizon. This will make you the most insane Horizon player in the game if you get this right. I always, like 99% of the time, I will use my Q and I will throw my ult. The Q gives you information, right? So if I use my Q, it gives me information. One enemy, two enemy, three enemy. I then look for perfect placement, right? It's all about the placement of your alt at this point. That's all you're doing. Now, with this being said, you have to be very, very, very careful if you throw your ultimate and they're right below your feet. Main reason being, if I have enemies, there's been plenty of times where I'll have enemies right on top of me. What I'll do is, is I can actually, like if I'm running from somebody, I'll actually throw my Q, slide, and then I'll point down. You want to be careful. You're not going to throw your alt like directly in your Q because if you do that, it bounces okay it will not place when i queue with the horizon alt i'm looking for placement i'm i always carry minimum two arc stars right if i can't if i have no other choice i'll throw i'll have one what i do is a lot of people think you know you can shoot the horizon alt and, and the enemies can shoot the horizon alt and break it right but what happens is is the reason why i throw two arc stars is this is all this is why the queue is so important when you get the when you throw the queue you're getting information, right? You're looking at the pattern of where they're running, right? You're taking a guess of where they're going to run and where they're going to turn, right? So the the point of this is, the, the, the point of the ult is it will suck them in. If it doesn't go off, if the suck doesn't go off, because they can actually use your ult to hide behind it so it doesn't get the shot off. But what happens is, is you're, you're going to throw it and you're going to throw two arc stars one on them and one on the direction that you think they're going to go this is pretty effective because you're 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 almost guaranteeing at least one arc to hit them right or at least an arc to hit somebody so what i do is is you'll see a lot of the times i'll throw my ult and i'll throw an arc here and i'll throw an arc here right and like my goal is that one of them is gonna hit that is the point of why I always carry two arc stars. I'll throw on them and I'll throw around them. Now, if I know for a fact that they're screwed, that they're that they're about to just get destroyed by my ultimate, I'll just keep chucking arc stars uh, at, at the you know at the direction. I'll try to stick one of them, something like that.
my the biggest thing is if if you Q and you throw your ult and you have like a frag grenade it's just it takes too much time to detonate where they can just get out of it right like an arc star an arc star causes more urgency and it can do up to uh, you know it can do up to 125 damage or another really really good thing that you could do with horizon's ult is right here so like let's say this guy this guy's in a door in front of me right there's a wall right here right let's say there's a wall between this person right so what i do is because i'm away from my ult but you can actually throw your ultimate on the side of buildings it actually goes through buildings you can throw the ult on the side like right here and it will suck him backwards so the idea for this is is if this guy is holding the door i'll throw my ultimate on the side of the building or on the side of the door and what happens is is the person's holding the door Voom, get sucked to the side i'll open the door and i'll shoot him in the face there's been plenty of times especially in competitive where people are going to be like there's me a team stuck in a corner and there's like the zone on their back i'll actually throw my alt stick them in the corner take an arc star and then throw an arc star on them i'll stick one of them right it creates extreme panic and just absolutely just destroys people what legends work well with horizon caustic can be really well can do really well because obviously his ultimate mixed with horizon is almost like a zarya ult in overwatch essentially gibby doesn't really do much i mean it's the same thing right gibby is like you toss the alt out you have to wait for the gibby alt to kind of go if the gibby alt is thrown first and you you can try to combo it for the most part the biggest combo i wouldn't say is necessarily legends it's nades nades are the combo not necessarily the legends but i would say probably caustic is gonna be your best bet if you're new to apex legends i honestly would say that horizon is going to be your bread and butter uh, it used to be Wraith because Wraith it kind of allows you to to be a little aggressive and press your 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 Q button, which is like an O button, and kind of get out. But Horizon teaches you the basics of Apex. I think Horizon is an example of what Apex is about. Apex is about movement, gun skill, and abilities. And I think Horizon touches base on every aspect of the game without the limitations of movement because horizon moves at one singular pace she doesn't have jump fatigue or, or fall fatigue she doesn't she doesn't ever really get slowed by anything uh besides like abilities and stuff but for the most part she's just on this constant pace so a lot of the times what you can do is you can toss your q out you know jump off of it and kind of hold your crouch button you know wall jump and you, you're kind of just always in this singular flow of movement right you can't do that on any other legend you can't just pull off crazy movement plays um, a lot of times you can jump off a building, right? Let's say, let's say I'm at the top of a building. I can actually oh, jump off the building, toss my Q out, and then you know slide back into it or jump back into it. Horizon has a has a really you know has a really strong kit for new players and really can show you the fundamentals uh, if for for current players and it really kind of mold your 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 style. Horizon is that bread and butter. I think she could be close range. I think she could be mid range. I think she could be long range. The reason why long range is pretty obvious. You toss your Q, you pick up uh, you pick up a charge rifle, and you beam people from, you know, 4,000 meters away. Brr, boom. Brr, boom. You're just hitting people. And again, you have 100% accuracy on her Q. If you want to get close up to people, you can obviously pick up your Volt. You know, Volt Mastiff. Um, if you want to be mid-range, you can pick up an R301 Hemlock. You really have a full arsenal of weapons at your disposal. She's, again, that that legend i think that is the epitome of apex if you're caught out in a pinch in a corner something you need something right you're like oh sh i'm stuck i'm about to die i've hidden in corners right like i've slid off buildings what i'll do is i'll throw the ult at my feet right here and i'll pop a battery right this is also absorbs 220 damage or 200 something damage so this will absorb all the bullets for me, and I'm able to pop a battery. You can't see me in the black hole, right? As soon as I'm done popping the battery, I press my Q, boom, I'm out of there, right? I need to do something. The ultimate allows you to also make a play to regain your HP and stuff like that. To be honest, I mean, her only weakness, like I said, is she's just predictable. Um, you kind of know what, what a horizon is going to do before the horizon does it. Boys, this is an absolute 20 bomb, and I'm going to need absolute pure focus. Let's do this. I'm going to land on this side. Did I not pick up the armor? Oh. A bit close for comfort, if I do say so myself. Let's 
Nice. So where'd you get the name Silver Fox from? I had a team once. It was called Silver Fox. You're pretty good. What's your DJ name? Oh, shit. See you walking in the club like DJ Silver Fox. Looks like, is that how it goes? Like something like that? Music producer? Okay. Okay. You do you. More house and dub. All right. So it's like. Like that? Sorta, okay. Um, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Watch this chat. But the cleanest, cleanest getaway you've ever seen in your life. It wasn't that clean. Hands up! This is the police. Come on, with your hands up. Drop the weapon. I'm not dropping. I'm gonna suck him. Wait, I didn't mean that. Not like that. I'm gonna go in there with my mastiff. Boom! 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 Pop a battery! Pop a battery! Pop a battery! Woo! Listen, can you tell your friends? You are so thick. It is crazy, bro. <laughs> Dodge. I'm gonna weave. You gotta practice your dodging and weaving. Here we go. Watch, watch, watch. Practice the dodge. Bob and weave. Bob and weave. Bob and weave. Bob and weave. It's okay. I know you hear that. I know you hear that. That's fine. Oh, you guys up. You're on the ground. Burn, baby, burn. I'm gonna stick it with this arc star. Got him. Three, two, one. Brady. Oh! 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 Wait. Granada. That's gonna hit. I heard it. Ooh, storm's out of back. Uh. Oh! Oh, you're so dead. Angels TV, I have a question for you. One minute until a nearby rain. I didn't know I was playing against Houdini. God damn. Oh. Excuse me, I have a question. Have you heard about our Lord and Savior? Take a point of damage. I'm nuts. It's okay. Caustic fucks with you. Okay. GG's, dude. Well played. I think we can go countdown, actually. Uh, go, go here. Go ahead. Can you sound the alarm? Or click? Wait. <laughs> I don't know. Said... Wait, we all like. You said go oh here. My God. You Get literally said go away here. From my purple. What Get the? Away. Get away from my purple. Ah! No! Fuck. <laughs> Soy Dora. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen the map? Oh my fucking god. That's Let's creepy. call the map. That's, That's gross. Stop. Ew. I can't hear you. Ew. What the fuck? It sounds real. You really do sound like Dora. That's creepy. Oh, there it goes. I got, I got. No, for, uh, I'm, I'm cheating. Uh, 
Alright, uh, yeah. I'm fine. What the? Uh, Thank you. Absolutely laser me. Absolutely laser me. I, uh, this guy's a god. I can port you. Hold on. I'm dead. Hold on, hold on, one. There's two seats. I got one. You guys down for business? Uh, depends no, on what kind of business you're talking well, here. Uh, we got ulted. Wait. <laughs> the team is... Uh... Oh, my, oh, my, my... Oh, big, 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 big damage. No, go, you muted. I, I, I hit one for 12. It was big damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mine, I hit both my nades hit them. What? Come this one, come I'm a fucking battery, Jesus Christ. Uh, no. what the fuck is going two on? down, two down, two down. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, that Gibby was sus. Yeah, yeah, same. Uh, this Gibby also. is so fucking sus. Holy shit. Wait, and it's the a same team? And no, it's a default like skin, health. but like, oh my god, this guy was yeah, beaming was... me. He'll be coming around the corner when, when she, she comes. comes. Eeyhaw! I'm gonna kill Imper Imperial Hell. Oh! oh. Guys! <laughs> Hello? Wait, I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> Lou, you, that guy walked right by you. 100%. Unbelievable. No, <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> that's that's I impossible. I just, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna comment. Uh, my man, uh, my man walked through our defenses like it was nothing, <laughs> all right? Actually though, actually Like though. he literally walked up on Dolphin like he owned the place. Right here. Right here, right here. Uh, okay, okay. Crack, crack, one, like, almost. Yeah. Please, potentially one shot. It's go time. I hit him with too much. Yeah. Rape as well. Horizon's weak. Arms are heavy. Rape is inside. Oh my god, I whiffed twice. Rape on me. Coming. Eyes to the sky. A care package. You're better. You're better. Get on her. Dominate her. Nice. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, wait. I'm gonna put two 112s. Well, when oh, you're fighting that Wraith, I said dominate her. And oh. Dolphin was like, dominate her. Dominate. Yeah. Listen, you always gotta dominate, you know what I'm saying? Listen. I don't know. I don't know. The only thing I'm dominating Maybe. is Taco Bell at 2 a.m. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Louis, you pick up that Taco Bell and be like, I'm gonna you up tonight. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna you. I'm about to do things to you that you <laughs> win. <laughs> I'm about to slap this Taco Bell around like it's never been slapped around before. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> nope, definitely oh. on, on the me. Door. Burning, burning, burning two, burning two. One up top as well. Grab us up, minus 70. Bloodhound what, cracked. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> what? What cracked? That's a... You're chasing one. I got him. One HP on the Wraith. I hit it for 190 on red. You're good. Someone's coming, brother. Someone's coming. That guy just shit on me. Just shit on me. He like took a dumpster on my fucking chest. I'm gonna be honest with you wholeheartedly. I mean that. Violet <laughs> feel a little bit there? Yeah, he did. He did. He fucked me up. 
I ba I challenged him and I was like, "What's up, little bitch?" And he was like, he basically was like, "Sit down, little bitch." Like he was 100. He dominated me. He was like, "I'm gonna choke your ass." And I was like, I, I was like, "Yes, yes, choke me." Uh, and like you know what I mean? Like it was, it was, just, it was that. It was bad. It was bad. It was bad. Well, you guys are having way too much fun with the D boys. Yeah, pretty much. Actually. Crypto one shot. What? I don't want to talk about it. Coming, hold on. Are we going? Yolo. There yet. Yeah, focus on me, dumbass. Uh, I'm up to I'm I'm one I'm one I'm one. I'm, I've dropped on double lock. So what happens when you push without me? Or you know when I push into Yeah, a, scan me. Look at that fucking penis. You like how small it is? <laughs> what? The bloodhound scanned me. Love we don't have to like go up all with all of their business, right? Yeah, we're well, right. We don't. Move me. They do be him looking at us, though. Yeah, well, they stuff. They smell bad. They do smell bad. Another soft landing. <laughs> one is Wait, one. Who's close? Is that a rope? On crack? No, because two teams are fighting, uh, us mix three and then mix four, so you know what I mean? That's true. That's true. No, no, good points. Good points. You actually crafting? Absolutely. These batteries are necessary to my survival. Yeah, it's a full team in time. Trust me. I'm burning, I'm burning one. Yeah, they're, they're going below, they're going below. All below. It's such a cost You're getting shot below, above, above. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same, same. Take the ball if you need. Take the ball. Come on, back the fuck up. I'm gonna go on top of this oh, right here. 61 on Jib. I'm taking my portal back up top. Just take okay. this instead. Yeah, yeah. 102 yeah. on Wraith. I'm red. Down. Okay. Come on. They're closer to them. Than they're pushing us. them. They're pushing them. I'm, I'm letting them. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. It's a portal back. Uh, ooh, 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 ooh. spicy. And he can see me through the fire. I can't. That's wild. His eyes are clearly better than mine. Fuck me. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> what the? That GP is weird, that other team. Like, really weird. Like, how weird? Like, weird, weird. Nah. He was crouching, like, crouch walking, and taking 200 damage. Are you here? Oh, I see that. Oh my god, oh my god. Shit on Crypto is f knock. Oh, yeah, that does. Why? Why would they do that? That Cossack knocked on another team. Yeah, they had a barrel in here. Yeah, it's burning my lungs. I'm healing, then I'm coming. Oh, right here, right here, right here. There's no shot. Inside? I don't know. No, on the outside, 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 outside. There's a, it's a Gibby on the wall. Or on you. You got him. Someone below, someone below, sir. Oh, Lulu? I'm uh, coming, Jimmy. Please, I'm a bat. I said I'm coming, Jimmy. Yeah. Where is he? He's dead. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, we're okay. good. Sorry, it's just a cosplay. It's just a cosplay. It's great. It's a raid boss, dude. Dude, I swear to God, you fight a fucking oh. I swear to God, we're gonna fight this caustic dude. It's like round one. Fight. It's like he's just fucking hard mode activated. How am I supposed to kill this Gibby? Yeah, exactly. Oh, oh you did I it. I got the rape us. Oh my god. On you. round one. You are the apex champions. Uh, imagine, dying to, imagine dying to spicy air. Like, what are you doing? <laughs>